Okay, everyone. 20 years of waiting. Was it all worth it? I think so, everyone. Well, let's get three early access. Here it is! We're in the game. Uh, I thought the first thing I'll talk about, just in my previous video, I thought you were gonna go up to 18 in your stats. They've changed that in the ability points. You can only go up to 15, but then, of course, with your rage, you can go higher. This makes humans. I thought humans were gonna be uh, not so good. I mean, they're, they're pretty decent because they get plus one in each stat, and that can help out a lot. I do think, though, that since you can't multi class yet, uh, I think a powerful thing you can do already is that you can select a race which has proficiencies for instance there are things the races which are proficient with armor and you can add that to like a wizard or a warlock or something which just have access to armor and you can still cast spells in that armor which i thought was pretty cool so that's what we're gonna do today we're gonna do a git yankee um a git yankee wizard because i thought wizard was really really strong when i played it so uh, I played Wizard and Warlock only so far, but I'm gonna play the other classes. I mean, I've uh, got companions, I've, I've seen a little bit of the Rogue, I've seen a little bit of the Cleric, so I, those are the characters I can talk a little bit about today. So, uh, I'm going to create like a like build guides and stuff later on, but I got a better sense about like what works for every class and stuff like that. So, first of all, Origin, you can only select the custom Origin so far, the other ones are not in available in Early Access. Then you can select a background, this gives you uh, proficiencies in different stuffs. Um, I don't know exactly what's gonna be the best here. There are a lot of Intimidation checks, so maybe someone who's pretty decent at Intimidation could be cool. Uh, who could that be then? Intimidation. Maybe a Soldier, maybe we're a Soldier. And then we go to select the race. So, here with the race, there's a lot of things to keep in mind. Here you can get a cantrip. A lot of races get cantrips, like Elf and Rouse, and get Yankee. And maybe there's someone else I'm forgetting. Yeah, the whole half elves, of course, also get a cantrip. And these cantrips are kind of decently useful, I would say. They're not super useful, but somewhat useful. What I think is pretty cool is the proficiencies that you get for the classes. So here, for instance, you get long sword, short sword, long bow, short bow proficiency. So for instance, if you want to have a wizard which shoots with a long bow, then maybe the elf is a good choice. Maybe. Uh, also, another thing which is different, different races have different movement speed, as for instance, the wood elf has fleet of foot, which gives him 10.5 walking speed, while the Halfling only has 7.5. So, the other class is Tiefling, gets a cantrip called Thaumaturgy, and if you're a, a Mephistopheles, you get the Mage Hand. This is the same as the Git Yankee, they also get it. Plus one intelligence, plus the charisma, hellish resistance, your resistance against fire, which is kind of useful. Kind of useful. Then we get to the Drow. The Drow has both the Drow and the Half Drow has Dancing Lights. Create a Wisp of Light that illuminates a 12 meter radius. I haven't found any use for this. Might be later on. Uh, and there's Seldarin and Lolth. Lolth <laughs> Sword. That's cool. Okay, so humans get plus one every stat. Essentially nothing else. Gith Yankee, which I think is one of the best. One of the best classes, I, my personal favorite right now, is Gith Yankee and Shield Dwarf. Why? Because they get a lot of proficiency. So here you get Great Sword Proficiency and Median Armor, which means you can couple this with Wizard. And they get a decent cantrip, the Mage Hand. The Dwarf, we have the Gold Dwarf, which has some toughness. Uh, the old Dwarves have Warhammer Proficiency, and I don't know if there's a difference between slashing damage and piercing damage, and if there's gonna be a lot of, like in the old Baldur's Gate games, like some things can't be damaged by piercing and slashing, like skeletons, very difficult to get with piercing, for instance, but very easy to get with the uh, um, maces and stuff like that. So I think Warhammer proficiency could be pretty good. The Shield Dwarf also has a medium armor proficiency, so I think at some point we'll also create a Shield Dwarf, but we're gonna start off with the Git Yankee. Uh, a half Elf, just to talk about all of them can, uh, of course, get the ability improvement. They have plus two charisma, and then you can allocate two points, but you can't allocate on the same one, unfortunately. Uh, I mean, it wouldn't matter too much. You're probably gonna go something like plus one dex, plus one constitution. Perfect for something like a warlock or something like that. Halfling has lucky when you roll a one for an attack roll, ability check, or saving throw, you can reroll the die and must use the new roll. That's pretty good bonus, but at the same time, they're very slow. Uh, 
uh, at 7.5 and they don't have much else. So yeah, let's go with Git Yankee today. And we get the Git Yankee Psionics, plus two strength, plus one intelligence, which is perfect for our wizard. Then we get two Aperans. Uh, unfortunately, you can select. But no room. Yeah, unfortunately, you can select male voices for females. I think they. Freedom, I guess, but <laughs> it's annoying if you accidentally select a male voice for your female character, or, or vice versa. I I'm gonna be super bugged by that, but maybe some of you aren't. Uh, okay, we'll go with that head. Uh, let's. There's a lot of. Uh, like. Can really customize the character. I would like white eyes. Her her eyes were white as ivory, <laughs> and her hair was long. And she had a beard. No, <laughs> no, not a beard. Okay. And her eyes or her her hair were also white like ivory. And her t tattoos. Had tentacles. No? Wow, that's scary. No, they were also white. <laughs> there was a lot. That girl was called Ivory. <laughs> okay. And uh, makeup. And that makeup there, beautiful. I mean, this looks pretty cool. Looks pretty cool. My god, Shay, I'm pretty proud of that one. Class? It's gotta be the wizard. Okay. Here are the cantrips. Wink, 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 wink. So what cantrips have I found out that actually work? So <laughs> this has been asked there also. Acid Splash seems pretty good. It saves against Dexterity, but it seems like everyone has shit Dexterity. I don't know why, because this thing seems to always go through. And it also creates a pool of acid on the ground. So this was the most useful that I've seen so far of all these. Friendship seems cool, so I'm gonna pick it up, but I haven't made it work a single time yet, so you know, it might just be very bad. <laughs> uh, and shout the non-hostile creature to gain advantage on charisma checks against it. I thought I was gonna be good. Uh, maybe we'll find a use for it. Maybe. Uh, let's see, a firebolt. Yeah, it can also uh, create flammable, flammable surfaces. Poison spray did not work a single time, I've cast it I think four or five times and it dealt zero damage everything because everything's saving against this. I think everything has a pretty good constitution, so uh, the acid splash worked fine though. Then for the spells, I haven't tried all the spells yet. The spells that I've tried that worked well, Find Familiar worked very well. The strongest by far was the magic missile because you start off with three missiles. It's not like in DD uh, 3.5 where I think you start off with one of these and then you get. You get one per level or something like that, no, one every third level or something like that, but here you get three immediately. It's just amazing. Sleep doesn't give a save, so that seems super duper good, we gotta pick that up. Um, what else do we need? Expeditions Retreat? I think we're gonna do... Could do Charm Person. We can Charm a Humanoid, but... And we get advan uh, we have an advantage on Charisma checks. I think we're gonna pick this up because it's probably gonna be a cool use for it. But I don't know that it's super useful. We could do... Uh, could do Grease. Uh, to give something difficult to rain. I don't think we're gonna use Grease though. So maybe. And Jump because it's probably some good use for a jumper. You can jump up some cliff somewhere to get some item or something. There's, surely there's something like that. Then done. Prepared spells. One out of one. Uh, we are gonna prepare magic missile. Yes. Uh, I thought you could prepare more than one spell. I'm a little bit confused. Oh, it's because... Oh, I know why. It's because we have too low intelligence. Yes. Yes. Now if we have 16, and we go back to our class. Oh. Can prepare four spells, that's, uh, you know, better. <laughs> that's, you know, better. Uh, so we'll definitely have Magic Missile, definitely find Familiar, that's kind of useful. Sleep, and maybe Jump. Uh, we're gonna start off with six hit points, it says, but we're gonna start off with more than that. We also get this Arcane Recovery. Once per day, out of combat, replenish ex uh, expanded spells, which allow it to cast spells. So this means that you don't have to sleep again, uh, but you have to do it out of combat, so keep that in mind. 
let's see here. Abilities. We are gonna go with... We don't need any charisma. And we can just use a spell. <laughs> if we need friends, we can just use a spell, everyone. Uh, we can get 14 constitution. Uh, so how do we want to do this? I think we want... We can't get higher than 16. Right? I think this is pretty good. We're probably gonna wear heavy armor anyways. Or me... <laughs> A medium armor at least, so we might not need all this at 6 uh, Constitution is pretty good, get some extra hit points liking that. Intelligence we need of course for our spells and strength is pretty nice because we're gonna be wielding a greatsword at some point. We're gonna get a longsword at least in this uh, very very soon. You'll be able to get a longsword and a medium armor. So I think it Yank is just... Oh, it's so good. Okay, it's so good. This game is so good. Let's venture forth. We're gonna skip the cutscene by the way. Who do you dream of at night? Wouldn't it be hilarious if we dream of ourselves? It's just me. Someone... I think we have a head too. And let's see here. Eye color was white. Everything was... Wow, no. Oh, 29. Come on now. It was like early. Ah, that, that's one. No beard. I just find it hilarious that we are... <laughs> very much... Dreaming about ourselves. We need, we need to zoom in for this one. That two. It was... Uh, let's see. This one. And... Like this with... Some makeup. Yep, 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 yep. That's, that's us. <laughs> Maybe this is our twin or something. Maybe there's a story about this. I'm gonna skip this cutscene. In the interest of time. If you want to see it, it's already online. You've probably seen it by now. So, I'm not gonna waste our time with this. A precious time. <laughs> mm. Mm -mm -mm. Mm. So, I've already played through this early game once. <laughs> I'm gonna say that I can die immediately or something. So I think I know what to do. <laughs> Everyone's like, you gotta screw it up. No, 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 no. That would never happen. It simply never happen. These are healing things, by the way, this restoration. So you don't need to waste your healing pots because there's always a heal in this tutorial area. It's always not a You can go up here and kill a dude up here. And maybe that's gonna affect something later on in the story, but again, time is of the essence. If you are to get anything done today, we need to move swiftly by the cover of the night. Also, if you hover over this, sometimes you see, yeah, red dragon, level one, 256. That's pretty cool. Added, that you can like they're there like you can hover over them they're, they're not just an effect they actually have you know they have stats and stuff I thought that was pretty cool thought I was pretty cool it's the nerd in me I love when you like early in the game you'll see some really powerful characters even if you, it's even better if you can see their equipment also and you can be like oh at some point I'll get that sword from that guy then you have a mission already Mm -hmm. oh, my head. What is this? <clears throat> you are no thrall. So you can steal all this girl's equipment. Spoiler warning. <laughs> we gotta do that before. Spoiler warning. <laughs> she goes away. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot of spoilers, isn't it? Yeah, but that's gonna be very, very soon. Anyways. Okay. The material plane, okay. We're gonna get to the material plane, don't worry. Don't worry, Malay. Okay, so I thought I'd just show you... Oh, I forgot to cast Familiar. Ah, oh, we can do that later. Okay, so, to explain combat there. Okay, this girl is first. He's, here are the normal things like attack, ranged attack, and so on. You get cleave, that's something that seems to be connected to what weapon you're uh, wearing. You have a jump ability, which is very, very useful. We're gonna use that a lot. We have dip ability, we can dip something into a surface. Uh, very much divinity like, I would say. Shove, that can push something. They can also do that with the mage hand, which I have here. We can hide, uh, which is mostly useful outside of combat to sneak up on something. We can throw something which can deal damage, we can dash to double movement speed. 
Uh, but this is also an action, so that means we can't do another action this turn. We can knock something unconscious, and we can help someone. So, uh, first I think we just move up here, and we're gonna range attack. Zoom out a little bit, that imp there. Ooh. And this girl has some armor, so she can just run up there, I think. And soon we're gonna see the power of the wizard. Uh, we could save these spells, but we're gonna be able to replenish them soon anyways. Let's see, we go one there. Then we can go, let's see here, two on this guy. We might kill both of them. Close. <laughs> Close but cigarless we were, okay? Well, we can range attack this guy. Wink, 10 XP. From here, Wink. This, all the fighters have a ability called Second Wind also, so they have a self heal, which is kind of useful. Kind of useful. So the fighters seem decently strong, I think, but like on level 1, it seems like every... Uh, by the way, now I'm ca casting Acid Splash. It deals damage to things in an area, and it's a save versus dexterity. Wow. <laughs> Roll the one, okay? Ah, it's okay. Sure. I didn't want anything higher than a one. Uh, wait, can we cleave both of these? Ah, uh, if we move here, I think we can. Cleave, yeah, that, this should work, right? Yes! Okay, so one dead. Just one to go. I was about to say, yeah, I think the fighter on the low levels, they're decent. Definitely decent, but I think just the wizard. My god, I'm so impressed by the wizard. I'm gonna jump up here. Because she's so flexible. The thing is, you can have a weapon and hit pretty much as good as, uh, as the fighter anyways. But uh, you also have spells. So we can go and heal her also. That's why I said, don't waste any healing potions here in the early areas. Shwing! And yeah, we'll go up here. Uh, by the way, th there's a bug where it, the camera doesn't follow, so if you double click on your character, it will follow. Kinda useful. Kinda useful! Hmm. Well, well, well. Dragons. So what is going on here? <laughs> you say, why are we on this ship? Maybe we should talk a little about what's going on. So what we know is going on that we we are the Git Yankee. Uh, this girl is also a Git Yankee, and she was hunting down this ship which attacked Baldur's Gate and snagged a lot of people and put tadpoles in our brains, put tadpole in her and put a tadpole in me and a lot of other people. Uh, basically every companion we're gonna come across. But you can't, by the way, you can't kill these things right here. Uh, they have infinite, infinite uh, hit points. We're gonna jump up here. Uh, to the helm. What, 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 what was I about to say? Uh, so the story is that they're getting a, these mind flayers are getting attacked by Git Yankee. The mind flayers are bad guys, but at the same time they're also attacked by devils. Uh, so I don't know exactly what's going on with that. Honestly. Maybe I should, but I don't. <laughs> Maybe I should, but I don't. Maybe I should, but I don't. You can kill these imps if you want to. I mean, we can. That's why not. I have like no HP. Akido! Bye bye! Uh, Akido Bababido. Well, and your turn, I guess. And this girl, can she. She can run up here and shoot, right? Range attack. <laughs> one damage. Roll the one. What's gonna happen? Miss. As you see, there's a lot of fire damage, so I don't remember who was. I think it's a tiefling, which is resistant to fire damage. That's gonna be useful. As you can see, the acid splash is so good, honestly. It is so good. 
Uh, we can do a range attack. I think we'll be able to roll a one. Wink, get some XP. Then there is actually an uh, one little hidden item here. Again, we need to double click when the camera goes bananas. Don't go bananas, camera. Don't go bananas. Oh, we can also uh, summon our familiar. Uh, my favorite is the crab. Summon the crab. The crab actually is a decent amount of damage. 2d4. <laughs> it is more than the, our main character does with his with her weapon. That's pretty cool. And that crab is just gonna follow us around, huh? Mm. So, it, it, this is about as much damage as this girl, I think. He, he only has two hit points, I guess. So he's not like super tanky or anything, but... I'm just saying, isn't the wizard kinda good? Isn't it kinda good? We're gonna save her, just to be... Uh, I mean, nothing's gonna happen, so I don't know why I saved. If you press the right one, these guys die. You can't fight them if you press the middle one. Have you played the game for 15 hours? No, I pl <laughs> just played a little bit. But enough to know these things, at least. Wink. And if you pick up the key from the Drain Cleric here, you can also open up, up a chest and get a piece of obsidian. A key? For what? Well, I'll show you what it is for. You can also sit in these chairs. <laughs> the vicious chairs. Nothing happens, but... You can sit there. You can roleplay that you're a mind player. So why not? It's why the frag not would give you that. Okay, elaborate reliquary. And now we get a obsidian stone, which might be useful. Uh, let's see here. By the way, before we go inside there, before we go inside there, we're gonna start a fight when we go inside there. So instead of what we're gonna do, we're gonna press E. By the way, I is for inventory, E is for equipment. Easy to remember. Uh, we're gonna unequip this. And. Then we're gonna, let's see, click there, you get the plate, you get this, uh, let's see here, let's see here, you're gonna do, unequip the sword, you are gonna get the sword, you are gonna get the quarterstaff, because she's not gonna be with us after this, so, so that's good to know. Uh, then we can also replenish our spells, but we don't need to do that now, we have... Or should we? I think we can do this again when after the cuts. Yeah, we'll do it now. Wink. Recover the spells. And here we go. Uh, okay, oh, one more door. <laughs> one more door. I remember that, of course. I remember. Wow, did I not get the sword? Did I forget to give the sword to the right... Ah. Ah, I wanted that sword, okay. Well, maybe we can change in combat? Maybe we can give a sword or something? Mm. So the devils are fighting the mind players. Uh, there are two characters fighting here. You can kill both of them. Uh, and they don't drop anything. And they don't give XP, so that's... Very much a letdown, I would say. Because <laughs> I spent a lot of time killing them. Okay. Uh, let's see here. E. Oh, it's our crab's turn. By the way. Inventory. Equipment. No, she's wearing the... Why did she have a quarterstaff in the... She's wearing the longsword, that's perfect. Okay, crab's turn. <laughs> crab won the initiative battle, of course. Crab time! <laughs> Crab time! <laughs> we need to get out of here now. Uh, let us see here. We have a magic missile. We can actually finish these guys off decently fast, I think. Boop. Move up here. And end your turn. You don't need to kill all these imps also. You can just run straight ahead, and that's the fastest way of doing this. But I think this is also really fast. I'm gonna dash. Move up. Return. 
bastard. Bastard. Well, I'll pinch you. I'll pinch you for your sins. What? How can I roll a 2d4 plus... How can a 2d4 roll a 1? <laughs> How is such a thing even possible? Well... Well, guess, guess you wait then. 2d4s and you roll a 1. Well, 1 there, 2 there. A badunk. And then turn. Mm hmm. The dash. Badank. Badank, bada badunk. Boonk. So you trigger a cutscene when you walk past the stairs there. Give that a man. Hurry before they strike. Scava! <laughs> I'm just assumed, I mean, uh, I'm gonna get Yank, I know these words. Skava! Uh, okay, it's this girl's turn still, so she can end the turn there. Eh? It doesn't matter if she dies, by the way. Uh, I'm gonna try to keep her alive because I want to pick her up later, but. If you if you care about the, knowing that. <laughs> I've played way too much of this early game. Okay. Nah! I don't think so. I don't think so. We're gonna ask the splash. On that guy. Oh! Akido! Okay, though. Okay, though, okay. Okay. Uh. Hmm. Well, we can do a ranged attack. Well, let's just do a ranged attack on this guy. Turn. I think our main in our main character we just beeline for that button. I think that's gonna be okay, Krabby Boy. Oh ho! Oh! <laughs> Pinched! What? Why didn't you deal any damage? Are these guys immune to pinches? What's going on? <laughs> I don't know why these guys got, can't get pinched. I have no idea. The odd thing is kind of pinched. Apparently, these guys were not such guys. Okay, we'll dash. Uh, don't walk too close to this guy, or he will get an attack of opportunity on you. By the way, Hook up here. Run here. Damn these imps! I need to reach the transponder. Ah, we're so close. Okay, next time we'll be able to reach it, and that will trigger another cutscene. Uh, by the way, this mind flare is. Friendly now, but if this guy dies, he becomes unfriendly. He's such a bad boy. Such a bad boy. We can just end this girl's turn, by the way. Won't matter. And, I mean, I want to pinch. I want to pinch one more time. One less pinch for the roll. One damage! Come on, crab! Come on! I was talking good about you all this time, and then you just pinch for one every time. <laughs> what was that? The double appearance. Okay. Main, that fire. <laughs> Main! An upskirt shot. <laughs> Good work, Lorian. <laughs> <laughs> you knew what I needed there. <laughs> Panty shot. Perfect. This is the manliest set of dudes singing, I must say. It's these guys and the one who sang for Skyrim. Bim bim bop. Is that what I'm saying? I don't think it's saying bim bim bop. Singing bim bim bop. This guy we can pick up. Shadowheart. Very, very soon. Uh, but it's not gonna be super likely that we succeed with it. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try to use friendship. 
the power of friendship and maybe saves coming <laughs> you can get this girl into a party you can kill her also um she has a shitty armor and a club <laughs> if you're interested why do you know these things don't ask <laughs> don't ask because i only tried to kill her i mean i wanted to see what happened of course for science for science we need to find these things out mm. 30 minutes. I think we're gonna get into at least one big fight before we end this. One big fight, get to level 2, and that's it. Uh, yeah, the fighters are a little bit underwhelming on level 1. The rogue, I'm gonna get this guy, this guy's rogue. Uh, also a little bit underwhelming on level 1, I would say. The wizard, amazing on level 1. Uh, what other things have we tried? The warlock is decent. Uh, the cleric, I would say is good for one reason. <laughs> She's actually good on level one. She has one ability called something like Holy Smashing Light or something. She can only use it once, but it deals a shice ton of damage. It deals like 20 damage or something like that. We use it once per. Uh, I mean, when you rest, you get that ability back, but it's only once in combat, so. Little bit limited. You can take one thing out almost for sure. But then you have nothing. <laughs> Nothing but nothing. There's our ship. Looking schmexy. Hello. My name is Drow. Hello. I'm checking out your ass. <laughs> Go away. <laughs> Go away. Don't check out my my wife's ass. Thank you. <laughs> Luckily, I'm not writing the script for this. <laughs> Okay, here we come. Rolling around, rolling around. Yeah, I know, this sucks. <laughs> We're in together now. Us on the mind, no! Oh, no! And then, I don't know spoil anything. You see, I think like two seconds. <laughs> What happens then, you say? Do we die from this fall? Now something saves us. There's some blue things here, so I'm guessing since it's blue, and mind flares are blue, we're saved by some force of the mind flares, but I don't know. I don't know what this is yet. We'll find out. Hmm. Oh, we're gonna save. Man, do I love saving. I think it is an auto saver though, so maybe you don't need to. But, you know, I love it. Oh no, my crab! Okay, find familiar. Do I give up on the crab now? Do I go for the spider? No! No! We've started with the crab. I've told you how amazing it is. Now we're gonna... He's gonna sideways his way through life. That's fine. If you're sideways right now, that's fine. <laughs> he's also kind of a meme master. He's like... Doo -doo -doo -doo. <laughs> The meme maestro. Well, there's some supplies, some apples, and a dead body with a perforated letter. And uh, you know what? I am a scumbag. I take anything I can find. Okay, we're gonna go into hiding here. I'm gonna try. I don't think it's gonna work, but I'm gonna try to. Friendship her. Oh, a little bit too far away. We'll go there. Come on now. Friendship. Okay, too far away. Friend. No, too far away. Friendship. Come on now. Ah! Oh, I didn't get it off. Okay. I don't know if we can get it off, but. I want to use friendship. Such a cool ability. You're one of that lot who were attacking the ship. No. You see what she sees. Feel what she feels. Distrust. Hostility. Because you are gift. No gift. Ah! <laughs> I like you gift. You were on the ship. Captain. Oh. I can feel the parasite in your head. Ah, sorry, by the way. <laughs> Walk away, flat nose. Not a step close. Flat nose. Oh. Is everyone on Faerun mad? 
resist your singular affliction. Oh, savage! Singular affliction! Boosh! <laughs> My cat was attacking the enemy. You don't look like the enemy to me. Maybe I have other reasons. Either way, come any closer and I will kill you. Uh, she will, <laughs> by the way. Wouldn't diplomacy be a bit more logical? I'm not interested. Well, if I pass a check, you will. Divide and conquer is a time sensitive strategy. Will you walk into your own defeat? Eleven. Come on! <laughs> did it! Oh! Uh -huh. Oh! Uh -huh. Gotta join me now! You gotta join me now! <laughs> we will survive together and be stronger for it. I suppose there's plenty of other things that are set on. Yeah, pass the check. Can't, can't just give up now. But understand that I'll have to join. The moment I have to. Roll the 19 as we get. Little bit proud. Uh, I'm Tab. Let's make haste. Right. But try anything suspicious and I'll kill you. Understand? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. What happened there? A 30 XP for that. Can we open this door? Ancient door now. Ancient circle. Oh! Oh, it's fast travel. That's amazing. Okay, so these are fast travels. <laughs> I didn't even know that. Did not even know. This guy, though. Hello. Hello, gold for, for gold coins. I take you now. We save again. Wink. There, there's probably a quick save. Yes, haven't figured out the button yet, so. Oh, you guys! Oh, you scurry along. I'm gonna snoon you very, very soon, you. Okay, commence battle. These guys are pretty strong. I think they hit for like 10 or something. Better stay back. One strike could be uh, yeah, I mean, it could be lethal, but come on. I think we do uno, dos, tres. Unk. Uh, I'll probably end the turn there. I mean, maybe this guy's been very strike. Oh, Should've wa should walked back. I knew it. I freaking knew it, did I? Well, we'll do the healing word then. Oh my god! And we roll like a boss. And we just roll like a boss. We roll like a boss. We roll like a boss. Crab time. Come on, a crab. Show your pinching powers. Oh, five! <laughs> Crabby! No! Don't kill my crab! Ah, well, I will have to cleave you guys. For your sins! For Asgard! <laughs> Something. Okay. Um, sacred Flame. 50% chance. No! No! How can you even pass? Shield of Faith, increase the AC by 2 on a character. Increase it on you. And then just walk away. Go away. Bye bye bye. Editor. Oh, misses, look at my armor. I have the Git Yanker armor. Plus 2 from the cleric. What could you even possibly do in a circumstance like. Look at this! Always hits! No! Okay. But look at this. Shove! Now he has to walk through the acid to get to me. And if he does, well, <laughs> well, well, as you tell, it's gonna be painful. It's gonna be very painful. Okay? Sacred flame. 50%! The cannot. Oh, 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 acid doesn't do anything, huh? Okay, well, let's just do a main hand attack. 95% chance of hitting, that's pretty good. For being a wizard, you are sure good with a sword, my lady. Resting with your party, we're gonna rest. Perfect place to rest, by the way. Inside here. Oh, wait, you can't rest... Oh, you need to rest outside, maybe. I'm pretty sure I was able to rest last time, wasn't the pro- Oh, go to camp and end the day! Okay, what's it? What's the one above it? I thought it was the other thing, okay? Okay, I messed that up. Should we lie down now? This seems as good a place as any to make camp. 
Okay. And we can talk to this girl. And maybe make her like us a little bit more. Hmm. I'm not sure hmm. this is a good idea. Maybe we can romance everyone. Um uh, You're not sure what is a good idea. Fuses in our heads. Sooner or later they're going to blow. Each hour that passes, the thing inside us grows. We need to find a healer. Let's wake up at first light. At first light. Agreed! Our uh, top priority as far as I'm concerned. Maybe we'll get lucky. We're overdue some good so gonna romance that girl. So right. gonna romance her. Look at this! Shadow Heart approves! Shadow Heart is gonna come around on the gift. She's gonna be a gift lover after this. She's a gift lover! She's got a rocking microphone. Yeah. Okay. Our uh, sleeping bags teleported away. Perfect. Okay, that's good. Now, enter a building. Oh, we need to uh, find our familiar again. Do we go for the crab again? Of course we go for the crab. Of course! There's probably something here. Vicious chair. Nah. Cartilaginous chest! Uh, <laughs> just didn't find this last time, okay? Blind, I guess. Basic poison. Hmm. Is there any other cartilaginous chests in here? I don't think so. Okay, I'll jump down. Badang. Badang, badunk. And was there anything in these? I don't remember. Oh, thieves tools. Well, that's kind of handy because we're gonna get a row in the party soon. Gold! Gold, you say? I'm the most valuable of them. I'm the mallish. gold. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. I don't know if that ever works. <laughs> to smash things open. I just want to try. Could have waited because we're gonna get the thief in like three seconds here. Eh? That would be easier than open that thing. I've got one of those. Brain things cornered. This guy's lying. In the grass. By the way, it, not to spoil too much. Kill the others. Kill us, Yalf. You look capable enough. I was hoping for a kind soul. Well, not to worry. Strength. Push yourself to your feet. Okay, what do we need? We need a seven. Ah, oh, we can get a seven. Come on, come on. Oh. Oh! Oh! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. We don't need too high a roll. We're gonna save our really good rolls for when we need them. I saw you on the ship, strutting about whilst I was trapped in that pot. What did you and those tentacle freaks do to me? Uh, yeah, it backwards. They snatched me up too. I saw. Your mind twists. You're looking out of unfamiliar eyes, prowling dark. Warrior cart. Street. <laughs> try to hold the memory, What's she doing? But it fades to the worm. Wario. Mario Wario. <laughs> For an antenna group. That's what it means. What was that? What's going on? Uh, it's the Mind Flayer's worm. It connected us. That explains things in some way. Mm -hmm. to think. I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. Yeah, it's fine, it's fine, 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 fine. Apology accepted. I might have done the same with the rolls. Oh my god, am I such a good girl? A Guy, I'm a girl there, but you know my what I'm saying. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Uh, not a strong and silent type. All right. Strong and silent type. Please tell oh. me you at least know something about these worms. Yes, unfortunately, they'll turn us into mind flayers. To... <laughs> of course, it'll turn me into a monster. What else did I expect? Although. It hasn't happened yet. If we can find an expert, <laughs> someone that can control these things, there might still be time. 
I'm mean, just gonna go ahead and guess that that actually exists and we will get these out of our heads. Control it, we need to get rid of it. Uh, you should travel with me, our odds are better together. I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd <laughs> isn't such a bad idea. No, it's not. And you seem like a useful person to know. I'm pretty good at things. All right. <laughs> what was that? Except. Instant Wario. <laughs> Wario Kart? You, me, Mario, <laughs> or Mario, or Luigi. <laughs> I'm always Luigi. <laughs> okay, we're gonna save. Just, you know, I save. I always save. Uh, these guys, you can get a little bit of damage on before. They should be trying to get away. Before the fight starts with these guys. Okay. Yeah, we got some damage. That's perfect. And let's try and do sleep on these guys, by the way. Ooh. That was pretty good. Not gonna lie. Not gonna lie, that was pretty good. Move up here. Yeah, these guys are sleeping. And let's see here. Let's do this is the guiding bolt. This is the thing which is a shy on that. I don't think we need that. Come on, damage. Oh, he wakes up when you do that. Okay, well, that's good now. I should probably have just gotten into position then. Pinsa boy. <laughs> ah, a little bit of an unfortunate position, I must say. Oh, we can. Oh, no, he misses. Crab boy, ah, oh, well. Well, well, well. Sneak attack, ranged. Five. I think the rogue needs a little bit more of a kit on level one. Something convulses inside you. Your vision lurches sickeningly. You are one with your assailants. Your minds fused together. They are frightened. Lost. The creature in the wreckage is forcing them to attack you, controlling them like puppets. Its voice shivers across your brain, seeking access, trying to bend your will to its bidding. Uh, let's see. Wisdom. Focus your mind. Ah, continue fighting. I continue fighting. We'll deal with that guy. That's not a problem. Uh, let's see here. This girl. Whose turn is it even? Oh, it's main character's turn. Here's what I think we're gonna do with, it, with you. We're gonna cleef. Like we've never cleafed before. Can't reach destination. You gotta be drunk. Come on. Uh. Slash them. Bam! Okay, critical hit on that guy though. That's pretty sweet. And... I think this girl can take the most amount of punishment anyways. Miss. With the fist. And let's see, a sacred flame though. Could kill this guy. Not super like. Oh, it did. It did. Mind flayer. Level 5, dying. Can we somehow kill that guy? Okay, we're gonna increase the AC on this girl. And your turn. Oh! Oh! Crab time! 55%! Ah! 55%! That's not 55%, that's like 0%. Okay, no. No, apparently not. Well. Ah, misses. That's good. That's good. Uh... I think we kill this man there. Oh! That oh! thing, it was speaking in my head. Oh, won't please spare us, no. My friends, what happened to them? What's going on? What's going on? They tried to kill me, I killed them first. You allowed the Gaith to use you. You are unclean! Uh Whatever yes! That thing is, it would have had me if not for you. We watched the crash from the river. I remember 
getting close. Hearing a voice. It said we were special. I thought we was gonna get to the, it's only 15 minutes. I thought we was gonna get to a big fight. But I think we'll save that for next episode. We'll do that first thing next episode. Because I need to record some magic gathering. <laughs> right about now. Right about now. Oh my god, though, this game is so good. It's so good. I'm gonna be playing it all night, all day. Um, uh, start by handing over your valuables. Shadow Heart approves! Oh. <laughs> she approves! Okay! Oh my god. That was so worth it. Pinch! Pinch him! Oh! One HP! Okay, that's close. That's close. I'll give you a pass on that one. Second flame. Good plant. Okay. Okay, we kind of level up. We'll level up also. We'll do a level up. Okay, evocation or aberration? Evocation spells uh, powerful attacks and aberration spells summon wards, banish enemies and nullify magic. Mm -hmm. Okay, arcane ward. Once per day, when you cast an aberration spell of first level higher, you can use a strand of the spell's magic to create a magical ward that lasts until your next long rest. The ward has a maximum of three hit points and absorbs all damage done to you. And if you lose the steroid points, you take the remaining damage, but the magic remains. Whenever you cast an aberration spell of first level higher, the ward regains a number of hit points equal to twice the level. Okay? And this gets scout spells. Create pockets of safety within your evocation spells. Allied creatures automatically succeed their saving throws and take no damage from these spells. Oh, that's what I want. That's exactly what I want. Okay? And then we're gonna get some more... I guess we we'll go with some evocation then. Go with the burning hands, and this we can't use because we are wearing armor, else we could have gone for mage armor. Uh, we can go for color spray. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna keep the things we have. Uh, maybe we'll... Nah, nah, I kinda like these spells. Kinda like these spells. And we'll accept. We'll accept this. And Shadow Heart then. Shadow Heart. She... Okay, no options here. She gets spell slots unlocked and she can channel divinity charges one. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. And this bad boy. Uh, he gets dash. Double your movement speed. So, oh, as a bonus action. That's actually pretty good. It's much better as a bonus action. Because then he can dash in, sneak attack. Cool. That is gonna be the first look at Baller's Gate. The first of levels. We're gonna play a lot of Baldur's Gate, so don't worry. There's going to be very much more coming very soon. There's also going to be guides and stuff like that. But now I just want to play through with this wizard. Because I really like wizard with the sword. It's just so good. It's just so good, everyone. Thank you, everyone. Oh my god, why am I casting you? I don't even know. Thanks so much for watching. See you tomorrow. Hey, everyone. I'm back again. We have the genius. Men be shout out actually. Men be shout out. Men 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 be shout out. <laughs> thank you everyone so much for watching. A special thank of course to all our members on the Patreons and on the YouTubes. Uh, if you also want to become a member, by the way, check out the join button next to the subscribe button or check out my Patreon link in the description. Thank you so much too. Adam Alexis, Simon Lauer, Rodney Cox, The Soft Pillow, Nathaniel Lister, Laser Set Stun, Michael W, Topless Investments, Peter Gold, Sean Stevens, Gabriel Jubilon, Wayne Messing One, Your Old Basses, Tai Tai, Eli Moonlight, Art, Gregor 2000, Rassif Fart, Invoke Legion, John Dominion, Gesasaki, Own77, Ellie Curtis, Noah BH, MC Hermes, Fumiaki Kinoshita, J Cap, Steve Draminskis, Kyrus of Zero, Tim Dutton, Jake Danley, The McDunkin, Relegan, Chase Closed, Hansa Cost, Agony Reborn, Ramen Noodles for me, Netherbex, Musketeer, Name the Epithet, Dear Lurgo, Dimlet Nike, Stricker Mike, Huan Tu Ying, Channel Fate Load, Adam Nixon, Ninja Astral, Optimus, Poki Yu, Medic Pistol Man, Seppi 1310, Martin Newman, Captain Loiskill, that's Mr. Gotti, Jake Palmer, Thomas Schwartz, Kyle Hoff, Yudu Robinson, Robert Montgomery, Salim Proctor, Zach Coyle, QGL889, some call me George, Paris Hammond, Bill Murray, Kyle Wedgwood, Patrona Bavaria, Robert Barker, Adam Jacob, Fernando Visu, Robert Lewis, Dr. Leos, Santa John, Geek, General Educator, Embracer of Knowledge, Joseph Suninga, Nate TMI, Shamanix, <laughs> Matthias Porlet, DJX Disorder, Carlos Ardines, Simon Fairley, Ivan Miller, William Cunningham, Kevin Yunye1, Limilainson, John Silver, AD Sibriosis, Yuri Lepikov, 
Isabel Nemi Lindfors, DJ D Star in the mix. Link is weak. Verokta, Dan Goodsell, Aaron Noble, Drew Styles, Adam Alexis, Matthew Goggins, Betsuma, Serge Carmaro, Freeman Stephson, Brandon Dobbs, DB Drummer, Rainbow Cake, Vantam Tanta, Piotr Stalorch, Ninja Longnam, Infinite Drog, Dr. Jaden, Javier Diaz, Adam Root, Barb McKenley, But With Ass, 7 Guys 777, Big Bob MTG, Patrick Henning, Liquidy, Thanatos, Nesmoth, Joe Mann, Yellow Beans, Patrick Parks, Martin Newman, Jonathan Burgess, James Hazel, Harshit Singh, Ethan, Alexandre Valencia, Lochinator, Travis Markley, Grinning Demon, Frank Show, The Foreign Sky, The Squires, I Ate My Neighbor, Utah Yase, Christopher Tonkin, Gudulape Hernandez, Bam Bam, Kevin C, Yoda for Sale, Trunks 305 in KC, Michael Brown, Mark Rutledge, Amber Parrot, Jacob Herrer, Rick Mr. Joe, Victor William Beer, Kleiner Duckel, and Dr. Bosky. You guys are amazing. Thanks so much for watching. And thank you also. Your bed shoulders are bigger. <gasps> what is that? What is that? <laughs> More videos. <laughs> Did not work. <laughs> Did not work. Also, you can check out my Patreon link down below. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. And see you tomorrow.